Hello guys, welcome back to Smriti Notes for Biotechnology. In today's video, we will be going through last year question papers of genomics and proteomics. Usually now the MIT has changed the course code, but the syllabus has been the same. So there may be chances that one or two questions may be out of your syllabus. but still you just google the answer about them and get an rough idea so let's start with the first paper that is of applied genomics and proteomics section a has six questions and you very well know you are supposed to attempt any five and how to attempt these questions i have made a video i'll share the link in the description box if you have not watched it then do go and watch it now just look have a look at the questions the questions come very directly so the basic thing what you should know is you should have a good knowledge about each and every topic in detail and maximum questions you will see will be covered from like molecular markers protein protein interactions or the maldi ya yeah, lsms technique and in case when you do not know what to write in an answer and you have a rough idea then do write everything whatever you know related to that question but do not leave that question and come for every question out there if you have a diagram possibly do draw it sequencing techniques is also very important and one of the favorite questions which always comes for either 10 or 20 marks now you have a look at section c where there are so many options out of which you are used to comment on any two so that's easy for you and answer for those comments should be at least in one page each now the next paper is also of genomics but the course code is different the syllabus remains almost the same if you find any question which is out of syllabus out of context so just leave that and never get panicked when you see the question paper and if you feel like i do not know the 20 mark question it's okay usually the 20 mark question comes in one or two parts so that uh, no one finds any difficulty now see in this paper again the first and second question have been repeated from the previous paper the previous paper was of my bsc days and this this paper is of my masters again a sanger sequencing question is being repeated so many times the questions are being repeated in amity so do go through these last year question papers from my from my experience at least 20 to 30 marks come from the last year question papers only you get a rough idea about the questions and those questions are always there in your paper as well do not worry for small small topics the topics which are important like sequencing chromatography protein protein interact interactions and its type do focus on those methods because amity does not give any question which is of one mark or two mark or three mark usually the question is of direct six mark so the question which will come will be like a question which can be attempted in one to two pages also i have uploaded the notes if you find any difficulty then just go through the playlist you will find the playlist of genomics and you can get the notes from there now you can see that some questions are like very favorite like this markers question it is always there in the question paper i hope this question paper will help you out and many of this questions get repeated do not forget to press the bell icon and like share and subscribe thank you